everyone, welcome or welcome back to JJB10. In today's video, this is JGBC episode 4, cycle 4. This week's theme was album cover week. Emma took her pass and unfortunately, Nenea had to drop out of the competition, which means that there will be no elimination this week. Alright, let's go. This first photo comes from Paris and she did Taylor Swift Fearless. Um, this photo is really good. My critique would be that maybe you can move her head a little bit more to the left because that is how it looks in the album cover. But overall, I love this photo and I'm a huge Taylor Swift fan, so this is really good. This photo comes from AG Peace and Hope. First off, I'd just like to say that please use one doll in this competition because, um, you used Leah in the beginning of the competition, and then you used Mary Ellen last week, and you said that you are going to use Mary Ellen for the rest of the competition, but this week you sent in a photo of another doll. I do not know her name, but please use Mary Ellen for the rest of the competition, or else I will have to eliminate you. I'm very sorry, but these are just the rules of JGBC. I do love the photo, and you did a great job this week, um, but please just use one doll. All right, thank you. This photo comes from Darby and she did Back in Black. I think that this is a real album cover, but um, she made like her own remix of it. I think this photo is super cool and all the dolls look so amazing. Darby is the main focus of the photo. You did an amazing job this week. I have no other critiques except for that maybe you could make it look like more of the shape of an album cover, like, you know, that square kind of look. Other than that, amazing job. This photo comes from June, but she used Julie this week. Again, please use one doll for the rest of the competition. Um, but um, this photo is super cute. It does look like an album cover. I love uh, the text and the way she's posed. Overall, this photo is really good. This photo comes from Caroline Estelle, and she made her own album cover. It looks exactly like an album cover would look. Uh, and I love how you made like this whole like glowy effect and all and because it's called in my head and all those photos of her and everything. Uh I have no critiques this week. She looks really beautiful and I think you did an amazing job. This next photo comes from Talita and she did Wildfire by Rachel Platten. My critiques would be that in the original album cover, her hands are not up and maybe I don't think that her hair is in a bun or maybe you could take her, her photo at like in between the bushes and not like right in front and behind the bush just because that is how the uh, album cover looks and change the text near her name to more of a spaced out look because that is how the album cover looks. But overall, great job this week. This photo comes from Jocelyn, and I love this photo. I don't know how you got that text to look exactly like the album cover, but it looks amazing. This photo is absolutely incredible, and it looks exactly like the album cover, like Taylor Swift's. Um, yeah, um, um, I, I have no critiques this week. This is just amazing. I was mind blown when I saw your photo in my email, and you did an amazing job this week. You should be so proud. Great job this week. This next photo comes from Tenny, and she did Cry Pretty by Carrie Underwood. This photo is really good. My critique would be that maybe her hair is really frizzy at the bottom. Maybe you could just brush that up a little bit. And the background, um, maybe you could make it like plain white or poster board just to make it look a little bit more like the album cover. But I love how you made it look like an album cover, like that square shape. Great job this week. This next photo comes from Issa and she did David Bowie, Aladdin Sane. My critique would be that maybe you could change the background a little bit lighter and um, also maybe make that lightning bolt across her face a little bit brighter and the text maybe could be a little bit more in the right hand corner. But overall, this photo is really good and I think you were really creative with it. This next photo is by Rose and she did Britney Spears baby one more time. This photo is really good. My critique would be that doll limbs do not go backwards, so that is why you edited her legs to look like that. Um, my critique would be that maybe you could have just made her legs go forwards, and I know it doesn't look exactly like the album cover like that, but it's totally fine because she just looks very, um, like she's in pain or something. Anyways, um, 
and maybe make the pink in the background a little bit lighter. And thank you for sending in behind the scenes. Overall, this week you did an amazing job. This photo comes from McKenna, and she did Olivia Rodrigo Sour. This photo is really cute. My critique would be that maybe you could add the little label in the corner for more detail, but this photo is really good. Great job. This photo comes from Blair, and she did Kelly Clarkson Stronger. This photo is amazing. Like, how you got the hand to be like that with the, the chain and everything. This is amazing. I have no critiques this week. Amazing job. This is literally amazing. Thank you. This photo comes from Nenea Alani. She also did Olivia Rodrigo Sour. This photo is really good, and it's super close to the original photo. My... I actually have no critiques this week. Great job. And the way you did that tongue with the sour is really good. You might have to zoom into the photo to see it, but it looks amazing. Great job this week, and the outfit looks almost perfect. This photo comes from Courtney, but she used her doll Leah this week. Please use Leah or Courtney for the rest of the competition. Okay, so... I think that maybe um, she could have her head more towards the camera and maybe you could brush out her hair a little bit more because it looks really frizzy. Great job this week. And finally, this photo comes from Clara. I don't know if you took this photo with Clara because I know she doesn't have red hair. Maybe it's the lighting. I don't know. Anyways, this photo is really good, but the album cover has more of these blue tones in the photo. I don't know, maybe you could edit more darkness into the photo to make it look like the album cover, but overall, great job. Like I said at the beginning of the video, there will be no elimination this week. Next week's theme is Green Week. Photos are due March 16th. Alright, here are some ideas for the theme. You can use any of these. Dress your doll up in something green, add something like a tradition or something that you do for St. Patrick's Day. It can be anything related to the theme. Alright, thank you so much for watching this video. Bye!